uh, Valley Galley. We're going to head in that direction to Scatman, where last year in July I really badly twisted my ankle, thought I'd broken it, and I'm going back. Right, well, this seems a little bit unfair. Now, come on, I want to go for a run. There are three uh, remnants of Neolithic forts. Um, these settlements are about three, four thousand. Flipped on sheep poop. <laughs> these settlements are the ruins of forts. They're about three, four thousand years old. What up here? Because of the rain, but I didn't take into account the wind. This place is so wild today, but I was up here during the summer, flew my drone, and the views up here are just incredible. started to subside, I think adrenaline was starting to kick in at that point. So I managed to get myself back on my feet, go back to the car, and then luckily what I had in the car was, uh, it was the middle of summer, so I had a, a camel pack called ice, so I took it out of my bag, wrapped it around my ankle, and, uh, and tied it all up. I was on my way to get to the top of that hill, I never made it, so I'm here now, and I'm gonna get up there. see my hat. Well, I had a brief look, looked down there a bit, and then I realized that actually this is really steep, really slippy, and I'm pretty sure there's a cliff down there, so... He's gone. My hat is gone. I did briefly think about seeing how far down that hill I could get, and then I thought, no, because I'd be really embarrassed if I died falling down there, and then they played this on TV. Well, at least I can show you what the top of Scat Hill looks like. This is what the top of Scat Hill looks like. That's Lord over there, which you can quite clearly see. Uh, 
Dive there. Dive there, it's Bell the Galley. And the coast road. up here that my forehead is starting to go numb and it really really hurts. Uh, that hat made a big difference. But I have an idea. <laughs> I don't look stupid at all. Uh, just in case you're wondering, is it really dangerous to get up there on your own and running? Uh, yes, yes, it could be dangerous. Uh, if something went wrong up here, if I fell and actually broke my ankle, it would be life threatening because it would be so cold up here. So, in my bag, I always keep with me emergency toilet roll, which can save your life, some kind of food, um, a little first aid kit, and an emergency bivvy. So, if anything went wrong, I would kind of crawl into this, unless it blew away in the wind. Um, and it's bright orange and I would sit there and await rescue. So, if anybody's into foraging, you may have heard of Nesquik cereal. Um, in case you wonder where it comes from, this is where it comes from here. Nesquik is a natural product that grows on the hills of Antrim. It's a, it's a it's a type of fungus that just sort of sprouts out of the ground and then people go and they pick up the, the Nesquik, they dry it out, they put it in boxes of cereal and then you have it for your breakfast uh, with milk in the mornings. So that's that's uh, that's some quality Nesquik right there. I might I might try some. Two things, next time, if I see the wind is over 15 miles an hour, I'm gonna bring a hat that doesn't have a peak in it. It's annoying because the peak keeps raining at your eyes, but if you don't have the hat, your head freezes. And the second thing I think I'm gonna do is start carrying a spare pair of gloves. At one point I was going down a bank and I slipped a bit and put my hands down on the ground, soaked my gloves, which completely destroyed all their insulating effects, so my hands were absolutely freezing. If you like this video, hit subscribe. I will be doing more running videos, um, hopefully in better conditions. I'm definitely gonna come back up here in the summer um, and run it when it's sunny and it will just be a completely different experience. So you wanna see that, please subscribe and I'll see you on the next video, which I think is gonna be um, about trying to shoot video using a crystal ball. I also find this hat fully glove mitten thing. Mittens. Mittens. Oh.
Oh! Post! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs>